bladder diary okay mm-hmm. so bladder diary how to interpret a bladder diary this i'll be telling you you have to always check the name age nhs number and it it is ideally advised for at least 3 days and mm-hmm. both day and night uh, should be included okay, okay. and uh, the values that you have to remember normal voided volume should be more than 150 ml in case the patient is voiding more frequently if there is small frequent void it is indicator of detrusor overactivity okay and daytime void in uh, if a patient is less than once uh, uh, less than 60 years it should be only once if it is more than 60 years maximum twice okay this is night time okay yeah. daytime is 4 to 8 times and if it is more than 8 times it is abnormal okay polyuria if there is more than 40 ml per kg in 24 hours okay. normal fluid intake is 1.5 to 2 liters and normal output is 800 ml to 2 liters normal fluid intake is 1 point okay this we are uh, instructing them yeah this is average intake for everybody like okay okay so this is how a bladder diary looks like how will you interpret if the patient comes with this so you you see here this uh, this is 2 am 7 am 8 pm uh, 8 am 9 am like this okay. so um, she ha- she is voiding multiple times okay. so if you count uh, in the day time from 7 am if you include 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 3 3 8 so she is voiding frequently ideally four, more than 8 is abnormal okay, okay. Mm. night time she is voiding only once to am she has woken up okay 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 so until 11 o'clock we are considering as day hmm actually it is until she is awake yeah okay oh. so bed time which should be uh, hmm less, lesser than 60 years means uh, once ha huh. uh, beyond uh, okay more than 60 it can be twice okay but here the volume should be ideally more than uh, 150 ml so okay. there are small uh, like yeah. there are frequent voiding and small yeah. small frequent voids mm. 60 ml so it is an indicator of detrusor overactivity okay this you are seeing here uh, this input is if you total this i totaled it for you it is 1600 and output is okay. 1230 ml which is normal so input and output is normal so how much ml is uh, this is input ha uh, how much she has taken, she has taken through the day and how much she has voided mm-hmm. so this okay. is in the normal range okay, okay. okay. and then uh, now uh, how many times she has uh, felt urgency okay so okay. from 0 to 3 she has to rate so three times she had urgency symptoms and with urgency there is leakage also so there okay. is this is called as urge incontinence right it is her over activity with urge incontinence because whenever she is feeling urgency there is leakage okay and she is unable to control yeah so okay. three times this has happened and also okay. with the coughing jogging also there is leakage okay have change so okay. that means it's a kind of mixed incontinence this looks like a mixed uh, incontinence there right is incontinence continent as well as uh, overactive blood bladder overactive ah so it looks like this uh, bladder diary looks like mixed incontinence right okay is yes, one so this is how you interpret yes Pro- stress Pro- incontinence is there okay mm-hmm. because leakage is there uh, with the activities also and yeah. uh, so bladder uh, over, overactive bladder we are making out uh, from overactive bladder because she is having urgency okay so there is urge incontinence with okay. urgency there is leakage also yeah and yeah. because on coughing sneezing also there is leakage so there is stress incontinence also so it is mixed mm. okay okay